Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi taklah wabarakatuh. Okey. Uh, Okey ni sebab tak pandai live tadi. Live screen computer. So saya record dulu. Okey. Uh, I want to to discuss this example. I choose one example from textbook. Okey, I want to show to you how we actually determine the internal moment okay using excel okay uh, this beam is a continuous beam the beam is subjected with udl along bc and a horizontal point load at the middle of member cd okay so let's start with Okay, uh, the table. The table consists of join member. Okay, I will I will start uh, calculate stiffness in the table. Okay, in the I because the I will be cancelled off later, and the F will be determined using uh, K value, and after that F E M. FEM is actually the first member and moment in the table. So, after that, we will start distribution. Carry over, distribution. Carry over, distribution. Carry over, distribution. Carry over, distribution. Normally, uh, five or six times distribution is enough. Normally, uh, after six times, the moment value that we get from table reaches zero. Okay, uh, what, this is one, two, three, four, five. Wait, I want to add another one. Distribution. Okay. Okay, here as we can see, there are four join. Join A. Join A for AB. Please remember that this is member and moment and member has two n so total is six a b b a b c c b c d b c we have four join b a b c join b c b c d join c and CD, DC is join D. So, there are 4 join and 6 member and moment. Okay. okay uh, since A for and fix A is uh, fixed, D is fixed. So, we will use 4 EI over uh, over L for member and moment. Uh, sorry, for for far and condition. Far and condition. It is four E I over L. Four E I over L. So for A B, it is four divided by twelve equal because this is the same member. And for B C again, it is four. Divide by 12 Again it is 4 Divide by 12 And CD is 4 divided by 8 It is 4 divided by 8 And equal 4 divided by 8 Okay I want to limit up to Using Excel We may uh, go to more than 3 but for manual calculation, uh, it is acceptable if we uh, use uh, up to three decimal points. Okay, I want to set to three decimal point or four decimal point. Okay, three decimal point. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Okay, for the distribution factor, since A and D is for and fixed, so fixed means Fixed means this is not the end of the structure. So, fixed means 
it is KAB divided by KAB per, uh, plus infinity. So the value is zero. So same goes to uh, DFDC. It is zero point five plus zero point five plus infinity in bracket. So the the distribution factor for DC is also zero. Okay, remember that you, we must know that distribution factor is actually for join. Distribution factor for join is always equal to 1 except fixed end. I repeat again, distribution factor at each join must equal to 1 except fixed end. So, DF at B total must be 1. Okay, now B is connected. Uh, third to BA and BC. So now we want to determine the distribution factor for each of that. So for BA, it is KBA plus in bracket KBA plus KBC. So since the value is equal, so it is actually like this. It is 0 0.333 divided by total. K at B. Total, total joint stiffness. Joint stiffness is these two values. Okay, it is 0 0.5. So, to get BC, again, we can use the same formula or we can also determine by 1 minus KBA because the total must be 1. Alright. So, then we move to join C. Remember that DF at join C total is 1. So, for CB, it is 0 0.333 divided by, divided by total CB plus CD. It is total plus CD. Okay. And for CD, it is it is 0 0.5 let's see 0 0.5 divided by total it should we should get 0 0.6 plus so it is 0 0.6 okay so the total is 1 okay we move to fixed end moment fixed end moment as i mentioned earlier fixed end moment is behavior fixed end moment is behavior okay so the moment the fixed end moment uh we act uh, so that the beam uh, the beam will uh, push back to its original position which is straight position so by using formula for UDL it is WL squared over 12 so WL squared over 12 is W is 20 L is 12 squared over 12 it is 240 BA is negative behavior so it is negative 240 and BC is positive 240 because of the behavior. Okay. For member CD, it is uh, PL over 8 for fixed end moment. P is 250. L is 8 divided by 8. PL over 8 it is 250. Negative 250 because of the behavior. So, sorry, I will put in the wrong column sorry we move this to this for b c and c b right and c d and d c it is negative 250 and positive 250 due to the behavior okay so so f e m is the first member and moment this is the first member and moment. Okay. First member and moment. Okay. Now, since member and moment and join moment is opposite. And we actually distribute joint moment, not the end moment. The, not the member end moment. So, what we going to do is, we must determine the joint moment which is occur at each joint. And that value we 
mass times with distribution factor like this okay for a b there is no fem so where we remain as it is for b for join b okay. for join b for join b b a no moment b c negative 2 40 so join moment it is it is which uh join moment is negative we are to represent to represent opposite condition so i put negative it is zero plus this negative 240 okay we put negative remember we put negative because the join moment is opposite is number and moment and we actually distribute join moment okay times with distribution factor okay we do the same it is zero plus negative 240 times the fbc I put dollar sign in order to lock the column. Okay, for join C, it is 240 minus 250. And total, we put negative. So, it is negative 240 plus negative 250 times with distribution factor. And I put dollar sign because I want to lock the column and the other one it is negative 240 plus negative 250 times distribution factor and I need to lock the dollar we put the dollar sign ok Okay, check the formula okay correct this one correct this one correct this one correct okay for the carry over since a and d is far and fixed and internal is also fixed so we must use the factor 0 0.5 for carry over so we must carry the value to opposite, opposite join. Means that if it is B, it is join B, the B value we have to bring to A and to C. So, B A we have to bring to A B. It is 120 times 0 0.5 means divided by 2. Okay, B to A. B to C, you get from B C. B C to C B, it is 120 divided by 2. Okay, we don't need to put negative here because negative is only for distribution level whenever we want to consider the op opposite condition of joint moment okay uh, for joint C joint C means C is between B and D so one of the value will go to B and another one will go to D Okay, it means that it is 4 minus 2, uh, sorry, 4 divided by 2 and another one, it is 6 divided by 2. Okay, so using Excel, uh, it is easier because what, can, what I can do after this is just to copy this like this. Okay, we may check the formula that okay that they use is it correct formula? So we check this one. Okay, so to calculate next a uh, distribution, uh, we will refer back. Uh, we will refer to the 
the above column in the last value the last uh, member and moment value and the value the total the, the joint moment we must times with distribution factor okay correct okay, this one correct this one correct this one correct and please remember that every time we do this we must also check this one okay for example this total this is equal to zero total this total this total this all this okay all this is equal to zero this is also zero total because we back to the concept uh, at at roller at roller B and C is roller moment is equal to zero this is zero this is zero so actually all all value is zero okay okay Okay, remember to stop the process uh, at distribution level like this. Stop at this level. Okay. Okay, lastly, we have to find the summation. We find the value start from the first moment in the table. First moment value in the table is FEM. So we have to add all together. Okay, summation three decimal point, three decimal point. This is n moment. This is n moment. Okay, A B is positive 62.625 BA and BC is 1 125.248 but in opposite direction because total MBA plus MBC is equal to 0 same goes to CB plus CD equal to 0 and DC since it is fixed end so it should have moment and the value is 234.258 Okay, we can check the answer. Where is the answer? Okay, the answer is correct. Okay, I hope you understand understand uh, how we calculate the member and moment for a continuous beam. Okay, using moment distribution method. Okay, the uh, the most important thing is we understand the concept. Okay, uh, please don't remember the step, but please uh, understand the concept. Okay, inshallah. Uh, I hope for your best, and we meet again in the next video. Assalamualaikum.